Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and play this all the way through. Then we're going to get into it, so let's go. Alright, now, as you can see, um, computer right here, uh, they use a pick and roll, right? And the pick and roll turned out to be a success, alright? But a lot of times, we already know, uh, when we're utilizing a pick and roll, it, it turns out to be so, uh, it, it just turns out to be real shitty a lot of times. Like, you can tell that your teammates are deliberately um, not really following through how they're supposed to, but then even on top of that, um, the uh, computer defense is just like, like they're not, like they're just totally unbothered by any pick and roll whatsoever. It's like sometimes you, when you actually get a successful pick and roll, it's because the algorithm opened up for you, right? It's not that you really, uh, uh, confused computer or was able to defeat their defense. You know, the algorithm has to open up for you a lot of times, but right here, let's check out exactly how it is that they were able to even get this point right here. So I'm on my point guard or well, my shooting guard right here, shooting guard slash point guard. And I'm guarding their point guard. And I know the pick and roll is coming. So what I want to do, obviously, is I want to try to, uh, what I always do really, is I want to beat him over here before, you know, before he's able to get to a point where he can close off this little opening right here. Right, this is typically what I do. I get over here. And then typically if he decides to go this way anyways, I got defense right here. And usually I'm able to get back where I need to be to cut him off, right? So when, they, when he goes for it, I want to get over there. You can see I take the step over, but they're not really allowing me to get through right there. Not only that, but the game forces me back to the left side. Uh, his right, but my left, right, if you're, if you're watching the screen. Uh, forced back to my left. As you can see, I'm standing here. Even though I start to move over to the right side, you can see my man, he just, he you know, he does like that ticking sort of jerking at a movement which lets you know that there's an animation being triggered it's basically being forced on me so now i'm you see my man moving making this shift over to the left that is the game making me do that right because what is it what it's doing is it's opening up the uh the lane for him to get over the top of the pick and roll over the top of the screen so it's moving me out of the way right now watch how it's basically uh the algorithm is working the court in such a way that computer gets a more comfortable and easy opportunity to, to pull off this pick and roll. Now watch this. So my guy right here, um, computer is on this man. Now I'm going to try to get on him, but I got on him too late. And I wanted to get on him because I knew for a fact that computer was just going to allow him to go by. Right? I knew for sure computer was just going to be like, all right, go ahead, do your thing. So I'm trying to get to him. And it was a bit, I was a bit too late. And watch what happens, watch what computer does. You see this right here, right? When he decides to take off computer, steps up and gets out of his way for him to get to the, uh, to the easy bucket. Look at this. He's standing right here now, instead of cutting him off or at least falling back and trailing him to the basket, he steps up and off to the side and gets out of his way and allows him to get the pick and roll. And I get on him a bit too late just a little bit too late and I knew that something like that was going to happen. I knew that that was going to happen. But as you can see, you know, he goes and he gets his bucket. All because of what? These little minute moments, these little moments that seem very insignificant. It seems insignificant to you or to the average player. But that is what they're banking on, the little moments that people really are not going to notice that seem insignificant that they could use those little micro situations that they can use to uh, implement whatever agenda they're trying to push for, right? So if they want computer to score, that's how they go about doing it, right? Moving, shifting players out of the way on defense, uh, uh, making you make little, any any false step, any false movement, every, in basketball, every little movement, everything matters, and that is what they're, operating on the little insignificant moments that people will look at like it's, it's not really important all right let's play it all the way through one more time slow motion on the man i'm forced watch this 
force out of the picture, boom, you see it move off, and then the computer moves out of his way also, right? All of the moving pieces, players just getting out of the way, opening up the court for the computer to score. This is done on purpose. This is done on purpose. This is not accidental. That's the, that's the main thing to take away from this. It's not accidental at all. This is being done on purpose. The algorithm is doing this to you on purpose. Right? Anyway, peace.